All right. I don't know if this is going to work um, because the final boss of this encounter is actually immune to defense down, which means that Porum isn't going to be very good. Um, but anyway, this is Lulu's LC uh, Chaos, and this is one where you only have one single target at the end, which is rare at this point, which is one reason I'm going to be bringing Tifa for this. Um, I'm going to be trying to go with a situation where I can battery and just make Tifa um, just blow this uh, encounter out of the water. I don't know if this is going to work. I don't know if um, Yishtola and Porum will work together. I know that uh, that Porum and Selfie will work pretty well together, but don't know if this is going to work, but we're going to try it. Um, bringing Setzer, since it is a single target, being able to use uh, delays from Setzer is going to be helpful. Of course, delays from Tifa and Yishtola will also be helpful. Now, I have not attempted this one yet, um, so we'll see how that goes. But it really comes down to whether or not I can get through the first wave. Because the uh, third wave, I have a pretty good idea of how it's going to go. Um, it's really whether or not really two battery characters is uh, going to work this out. But I think this is more or less an easier one just because it's, uh, uh, it's, only, two, uh, it's only one single target at the end. And if I recall, there's not really much to these. Yeah, I remember thinking I'd bring Celis, but I don't think Celis is really gonna tell me that much. Um, so we'll see. Uh, I wanna break it this way, though. No need to use Beat Rush all the time, quite yet. It's just going to be a massive skill um, toss toward the end, but I don't need to do that quite yet. Uh, and I don't think I'm going to open Cry yet, because I'm pretty sure that I'm going to be doing a lot of uh, Cries at the end. So, I'll just do an HP attack here. Battery everyone up, which means that Tifa is going to have a little bit of a go in the f very near future. Oh yeah, she only does one um, brave attack. <coughs> right, right, right. So I got to be careful of that. I, for some reason, I thought um, Tifa's HP attack actually did two brave hits, but that is not the case. Uh, so, and of course, right, with Yishtola, you can kind of spam skills a little bit, because you're going to get some back. Um, so, I want to point out that this is six months out from Tifa, oh, uh, sorry, um, Porm's were debut. Uh, sorry, Porm's debut, which means that if this works out, then this really cements to the fact that um, Porm is evergreen, and she is not fine for every single encounter. But a lot of people really, really give her a lot of a hard time when she's a lot better than advertised, really. Um, and I might make a series on that, like not really much of a, not too much of a, uh, uh, make, not make it too much of a thing, but I do want to kind of feature Porum, um, doing as well as she does, which is very well, actually. And let's split this a little bit. And now we'll start doing a cry. Because while these guys can get uh, debuffed, the boss cannot. However, I'm going to be using heavy uh, batteries 
moving forward. Um, I'm also considering, because A, I take a long time doing this and uh, to do these fights, and B, I'm thinking what I might do is I might start taking the video, like the actual video, um, speeding it up and then just taking post commentary because I don't know how well this is going on live commentary and even if it was, I don't think that's helpful uh, for many people. So, considering some changes on that. But yeah, if I can just uh, speed these up to 10 minute videos and um, just kind of giving a little bit of uh, what you need to know about the about the encounter, I think that's probably a little better than doing live commentary, really. Because I'm really just um, interested on providing the strategy much more than I am actually um, trying to do live fighting here. Okay, I actually don't know what this next attack would be, but I think I can assume it's gonna be something to deal with. Um, so, I'm gonna battery myself up, probably do an HP attack afterward, and bam. That batteries this up, and uh, oh, this actually is an HP attack, okay. Uh, so. Let's give a little bit of that going. Easy, easy. Have two healers, so that's always fine to do. Um, so, just gonna worry about that. Yeah, as long as I don't get uh, one shot, like, anything's fine. <laughs> I think I'm getting Dolphin Blow right now, so if I am, that'll help, but if not, then, oh well, whoops. Uh, no, and I don't want to do a Bow Cry right now. Fever Time, eh, maybe I will. Yeah, let's let's just do it. It'll give me some good damage. Well, this will be a good time for a cry, but I don't really want to. I'm doing Madagar. Okay. Could have easily been an HP attack. I guess they. I guess this is kind of an uh, easier chaos. Um, okay, so there's a lot of turns between B and now, so I'm not too worried about the damage there. Um, Tifa's not going to have much going on. Okay. I'm gonna do this, battery up, and then um, go back into this, and that gives Tifa quite a lot of opportunity to um, actually. I should beach rush down a little bit. Uh, 
Um. That'll take it to cap, yeah. See, one of the things that Yashtola really has nice is um, the HP attack doing the battery before um, going into the attack, which is one of the things that makes uh, Porn's realization uh, really good as well. So, looking forward to that. See, they do that, but as long as I uh, don't have to worry about the actual HP t uh, damage after that, then it's kind of not too bad. Um, I'm just questioning whether or not I wanted to do the dolphin blow now or wait. Now, the thing about that is that what next wave, I believe, is just normal wolves. Um, so I'm not too threatened, but let's just... Yeah, okay. I didn't know if that would kill or not. So that gives me the opportunity to... get battery on this, and then be able to do the dolphin blow on... Actually, I, don't, I might keep that too. Yeah, I might be stalling on that as well. Okay. So I'm gonna stall on the EX on Tifa as well. See how this goes, that's fine. HP attack, and yeah. So I've used very, very few skills moving into this. Which I'm very happy about. Open the car immediately. So, yes, of course, um, every single normal debuff is, uh, or every down is, uh, not available, but poisons would, but I didn't go that route. Uh, so, I guess this is just gonna be a delay kind of thing here, <laughs> moving forward. I guess I could have kept the brave, but eh, it's fine. Now, I don't quite know the pattern. I do know that this guy moves between uh, physical resist and magical resist. So uh, I'm going to have to be a little careful about how that turns out. But I think it'll be uh, okay. Um, so yeah, it's time to spam Beat Rush. Because... Um, Less turns they get, the better. That goes good. Oh, okay, so is he gonna do laser? Because laser, I know, is a magic attack, and I guess he's gonna do that a couple times. What? Which down is this? Uh, just resist down. Okay, okay. So cry is only gonna be good for battery. So. If I can do Beat Rush right now, that's going to dump the battery. Then I can do a Medica. And that's going to go back into a full battery thing. Okay. So let's do that. Oh, even better. Actually, I don't want to... Hmm. I 
I don't want to dump my brave, but I think it would be foolish not to. If I had Porm to go in front, but there's no way to get that done. Oh, the stone. Um, and yeah, this will just be what it is. What's the all attack here? Oh, an HP attack. Okay, okay. So I guess I might go and use Setzer early. Try to push this back a little bit and control it a little better. Okay. And who am I going to take out for that? It would be Porum because Porum's not going to... Uh, Um, Porm's not gonna do a little... Porm's gonna do less on the, uh, the delays, which is what I want right now. Um, do I want to go to summon, though? Not really. At least not until I can get Medica up first. So, the first one's gonna be unsummoned, but the... Moving forward, it will, uh, go into summon right now. And do a Medica, and then I'm probably going to stone, stone spam until I can uh, think otherwise. Uh, yeah. Whew, I don't want to do Beat Rush with that, but I guess I kind of committed to it. Well, that's what it is. Technically, that gives me an extra, uh, extra Brave, because that's going to give me more coming out, so... Okay. Ah, shit, I didn't set up for that at all. <sighs> it's probably still better to do it anyway. Well, if I knew it was only going to do 3,000, I would have... Just dump the brave, uh, yeah, dump that brave, oh well. Medica's still good. That makes me, uh, go on this. Be able to delay a little more. And I'm. Gonna HP attack actually here. So yeah, this is this is kind of the, the the problem that Square has with this game. It's like, well, we can't put in a bunch of uh, single target bosses because then you get this kind of shit going. But if you do it with um, three bosses, then AOE nukers are gonna just dominate. So like. They kind of have a little bit of a of an issue on what they can do. <laughs> so that's one of the problems with having literally like you know like between a hundred and hundred fifty characters. You know you're gonna run into a situation where um, 
you can find a team that can just do anything. Okay. So, still not even sure what um, this attack coming is, but uh, I'll try to be prepared for it. That's probably the last time I'm going to do an HP plus um, on Tifa. You know what? That was that was kind of a waste. Okay, I thought it would follow up with. HP attack, but it did not. I'm gonna assume that buff is max brave. Let me see if it is. Not that I can do anything really, but no defense up. Hmm. Well, I don't have anything to do with that. Hmm. Uh, so we'll go here. I guess technically I could have brought a Dispeller. Ferris wouldn't have been useless. But, oh well. Just gonna dump here. Because the next... The next thing they do is just gonna be a battery. Um, ooh, defense up. So if I keep delaying, I'm not going to get rid of that buff. I didn't think about that. I'll just have to try to work it. <laughs> Besides, if you have enough battery, then it doesn't really matter, does it? And also, technically, I could get it confused off, but probably not. I guess that's what that does. Uh, let's get one more of these. So yeah, Tifa is still working it. Um, I think that more or less she's being overshadowed with uh, RNA at the moment, but what can you do? <laughs> Uh, just in case this is an HP attack, I went ahead and gave it on Yishtala, but she missed it, so worked out for the best. I thought about using stone, but I think I'll, I think I'm going to see if I can get that deep, uh, or rather that defense up off. Um, if I can, which is why I'm also gonna let that happen, and white wave and hope that whatever is the next attack isn't too bad. Yeah, you're starting to see a meta that I'm hoping will work when I get selfie, and that is uh, two characters alternating brave dumps and ignoring enemy defense. Um, with Porum, what that's going to do is gen is leave a lot of brave like you know this with thirty thousand. But if I can get Porum uh, to prevent most of that HP damage, it should be fine. Whether or not this plan is going to work, 
I don't know, but that's something I've been planning on for quite a while. Um, now you all, you already have your thing, right? Yeah. So I'm actually gonna cry instead. Okay. I guess I need to break something. That's one of those things where I, it's like, oh, I guess I messed up and Tifa doesn't have her uh, her beat rush. Because um, that's one of those things with Tifa is she needs to be able to uh, break in order to get the beat rush. Um, so got that going. I think I probably could have done this fight a lot better if I was a little more proactive on batteries here, like, for example, br uh, Porm isn't going to do anything. I should have just dumped there. Why did I not just dump? Um, so, yeah. Uh, it's going to hit all, but as long as uh, Ishtola can be fine, that's fine. Okay, okay. If this hadn't worked, I was going to try your sh uh, Shalada instead of Porum, actually, but this is. I guess this is going to work. Um, probably not as safely as, uh, or rather not as, uh, quickly as I would have thought, but I think the time limit is, oh, eight, uh, 100. Oh, I need to hurry up. <laughs> I thought it was, like, 110. In that case, a little more damage, a little more damage. Buff is not defense. <laughs> well, shit. Um, I might not uh, hit this unless this does it. Fucking around with battery too much. No, I got it on the turn time. Um, so yeah, this was almost a loss, but I could have done a little better. Um, I could have set up battery for dolphin kick a little better, which I didn't do too well. Um, but Tifa is still really, really good against single targets. So it's hard not to, it's hard not to say that she isn't. Uh, of course, our Neo would have broken this apart, but whatever. Um, as long as you have a s good single target character, like Tifa, um, you'll be fine. Porum was just me being flexing. I, I was just flexing, really. Um, you probably could just go with one of Porum or Yishtola. You didn't need to bring both. And then just bring a better damager, like... Um, I thought about using Cloud. Cloud wouldn't have been too bad. So, anyway, thanks for watching.